All right, let's say I have my raccoon guy here. He has an animation. And if you look at this, it loops at 120 frames. This is how I preview the loop. But you can see he has fluid movement, fluid movement. And now he just kind of slows down to zero and then starts over, right? Like you can see he slows down here, starts over. So if I want to loop it properly, what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy the whole animation once like this. I'm going to set two keyframes here. And then I'm going to copy the whole animation like this. So two frames here, delete the start, delete the end, and now it doesn't slow down anymore, right? He still keeps going. I guess the animation is a bit slow, so you can't see it properly, but you can see he's still moving. He's still moving, 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 right? And now you export the animation and you get exactly your 120 animation frames, even though my previous is 250, which it doesn't matter at all.